let's crack on. Um, copycat sister hijacked my wedding day. My heart stopped watching Love Island. Now my heart would stop at the very thought of watching Love Island. Oh no, no, no. Mm. Um, evil stepdad abused me as mum slept beside us. So it is really, I mean, it's Happy New Year, guys. Come on, let's get with it. We've got puzzles, we've got holiday advice. Doc sewed my bum cheeks together, but it only made my sex life worse. Mm. Uh, right, okay. Um, I, I can't show you these, but if you look at the picture, I don't I think it was the bum cheek thing that made her sex life worse, but why on earth doctors are sewing her bum cheeks together? I've got absolutely no idea. So if anybody knows, could you please let me know in the comments? Thank you. We have well-being news. In fact, this isn't just well-being news, this is well-being advice. Here we go. Um, one minute bursts of getting out of breath during the daily tasks is almost as good for you as intense workouts. No, it's not. Sod off. And it says here that actually it's just, it, it's encouraging you just to have those one minute spurts with your children. What are you going to do? Sit them down in front of the television for the rest of the day? Absolutely appalling. A recent study has shown that one in six people have chosen a sleeping divorce. This actually just means that they sleep in different beds. These magazines are so informative and I encourage you massively to grab one if you can the 30k booty now it does actually have a pound sign in front of the 30k but I think if you take the pound sign away you'd probably be on the on the nail there we're back to aren't men daft okay, okay. no this is good yeah, yeah this is brilliant fancy that my friend Rob is usually a kind caring person but apparently when he puts a wig on from a charity shop um, and puts a leather jacket on then it makes him really evil what is wrong with everyone these days oh um, somebody else has written in saying um, here's my 39 year old schmooshable hubby making the most of the sun's rays on a recent trip to some beach somewhere some shithole i'm sure of course his four-legged bestie tilly isn't far away either well i think actually tilly is quite far away and it would seem that everybody else is far away because there's nobody else on the beach so saves you a bit of embarrassment love right we're at letterbox now um i'll just read you one of these um compare the meerkats um, my son and I went on a meerkat experience for his 16th birthday. He absolutely loved it. He must be a bloody good actor. Your 16th birthday, being taken to see some meerkats. You're going to have problems, ahoy, my love. OK, guys, we have now got Find the Cat. It's back. Yes, and this time you have to find a cat. You win £50, by the way. Find a cat amongst a picture full of crisps. Mm, should we move on? Right, love TV. No, I don't. Here we go, guys. We've got Weight Loss Wonder. Whew, this is going to be good. This is some lady, and I use that term loosely, by the way, um, who has apparently lost some weight. Well done, you. And she's just telling us how she's done this. Shall I just fill in the gaps? Why I lost weight? You ate less food. How I did it? You ate less food. How I keep it off? you're eating less food. Why I feel fabulous? Because you haven't been chowing down so much. My weight loss tips, eat less food, basically. There we go, bird-brained. Well, I think that should be the title of pretty much everybody that's in these magazines, but there we go. Um, a turkey that needed a new home because it kept chasing its owner's daughter around and scaring their dogs, and it's found a new home. We're all going to sleep better tonight. Good on you, turkey. Well, I'd say turkey. Well done for getting it through Christmas. Nice one, mate. There we go. But apparently, um, the lady that has actually um, taken the turkey on, um, she's a vegetarian, so it, it's got at least another year to live. We have got a bit of advice here. You love the advice. I know you do. I have 
never been in a romantic relationship with a woman due to the fact that I tend to be painfully shy around women in general. Okay, however, I am not a virgin by any means. No, because, look, I'll skip the rest of it, he sleeps with prostitutes and he's wondering why he can't get a girlfriend. What an absolute mug. A bit of New Year joy here. He's no war hero, he's a cannibal. Now, please stick with me. Um, I've got a bit of a competition coming up. If you have an amusing comment, um, and I think it's the best one for the month, I'm going to actually have it put on some of my merchandise. So please, fill your boots. And don't forget to watch my outro, which is coming up right now. Now, don't be forgetting to like, subscribe, it's free. And also comment, it's absolutely brilliant. Thank you.